I've been putting off making this video for many, many weeks now. I love, love, love filming these videos because when I find a product that I love and I use it till the bottom, I think it's worth sharing. But I have this dilemma where I'm almost always close to the bottom for at least one product. So I push off these videos because I'm like, oh, I'll film the video once I run out of this. And it just, I'm always about to run out of something. So I figure I'll film this baby now and then we'll do another one in a few weeks when I run out of some more products because it's inevitable. This is what we've got for empties the last two months. I believe and I think this is my first YouTube video in my new apartment so you could probably see in the back it's a little different than the last empties haul I'm still living in the same general area I just moved a few blocks away we have a bigger apartment now we did a little upgrade all right let's get into it first thing I'll share which isn't really like beauty related but it is wellness home e it's these little laundry pod tabs from laundry sauce it comes in a box like this and there's I think there were like 60 little pods in here the ones that you just throw into the the laundry and then you're good to go this is the best smelling laundry detergent i have ever used in my entire life this fragrance siberian pine trust get it it's so good we just ran out of this box like three or four days ago and we just placed another order because it is so amazing this fragrance is to die for there's this joke between rafi and i now when i give him a hug i hold on longer because his clothes smell good and he's like you don't want to hug me you're just smelling my clothes and i'm like oh no but like yes it just it's addicting next product is this hair serum from kerastase 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 one or the other or maybe neither this i really really like so the whole thing with this is that you put four doses on your head per day and four like one dose is like a full dropper of this and you put it on your scalp and it helps with hair breakage it helps prevent your hair falling out basically overall hair health it says on the directions you're supposed to use this once a day for six weeks and i think this bottle i was using once a day i ran out after like three weeks so i think you need a few bottles to reach that suggested timeline it's just one dose is like a lot like you use like half this dropper so it runs out pretty quickly i loved using it for the few weeks that i was using it before i ran out and i will be getting a restock of it because i love kerastase kerastase and their products have always worked well for me next is this little hand balm from kind this kind of feels like a Vaseline that's kind of like the consistency of it. It's really thick really hydrating I used this in flight a lot because your skin gets so dry when you're traveling and this just like Locked in the moisture really likes this next up. We have two mascaras. These are two of my all-time favorite mascaras This one from Lancome is the Idole Idole lash this is what the brush looks like this one is really great for separating your lashes and lengthening them next one is this mascara from say i would honestly say the same thing about this for the lancome one great separation great volume great length this is what the brush looks like for this one the wands and the actual product 10 times next up we have this face wash kale and green tea spinach vitamin superfood cleanser from youth to the people i have this big bottle and then i have a small tiny one that i keep in my suitcase for all my travels so i've mostly been using this big bottle to refill my smaller one for all my trips it really feels like when you're cleansing it feels like there's superfoods being absorbed into your skin it's a light green color and it smells really good i love this cleanser next is the hair oil this is the verb ghost oil i really liked it it's pretty weightless it was smoothing it my hair really shiny i like this a lot i would buy it again another hair oil i gotta say this is my favorite hair oil of all time this is dp hughes color fresh oil therapy it's tiny so it's easy to travel with but it's large enough that it lasts you i use this morning and night as often as i can it makes your hair so shiny it absorbs so well i'm obsessed chef's kiss next is dental floss i made a vow to get better at flossing so far so good this is from boca it's the ella mint floss and i really liked this next we have this sbf mister from habits this is the orange one i don't know if there's like a fragrance i don't remember there being fragrance to this but it's the number 41 mister any sunscreen misters i'm obsessed with because they fit into your purse so well they fit into a little travel bag your pocket before i leave the house i do my mental check do i have my lip balm my wallet slash just a credit card my phone SPF. I don't leave the house without SPF. It's just so easy to apply when you're walking around. You miss it on your face. You can put it on your shoulders, your chest, whatever. Easy, easy, easy protection on the go. Seriously, SPF misters have become non-negotiables for me 
Every time I leave the house, I always have one with me. Next is this foot balm from Herba Viva. I really like this brand. This is just a really great foot balm for putting on your feet, like around your heels and ankles for extra moisture. It smells really good, it's clean. The best way to use this, in my opinion, is to put the balm on your feet, put some socks on, and then go to sleep. And it just feels like you wake up in the morning if you had any cracking from the winter, whatever it is, the moisture barrier is just completely replenished. There's no more product in this, but the fragrance still lingers. It smells so good. Next is this scalp and body scrub from Way. It's in this teeny tiny jar. I tried to use this scrub on my scalp and I didn't love it. So even though it's a hair and body scrub, I used it more as a body scrub. Loved it as a body scrub, as a hair scrub, not my first choice. Next up is this eye serum from Youth to the People. I love vitamin C anything. This is called the Peptides and C Energy Eye Concentrates, brightening and smoothing and depuffing. I use this eye serum a lot in the morning and then used a thicker one at night, but this one's really brightening. So I liked the idea of doing vitamin C in the morning and I put it on my ring finger and just under both eyes. The thicker one that I use at night is one from Kiehl's and it's like an avocado eye mask one. Love it, I recommend it, you should look into that too. It looks like a tiny bottle, but this lasted me forever. Your eyes are such a small area that you really don't need a lot of product every day. Next one is this little lip balm from COSRX and the label's not even on it anymore because they make it really easy to peel the label off. I just kind of liked the look of it not having a label on it, so I peeled it off. I don't remember the exact product name of this, but by the time this video is uploaded, I will have a link to the product or at least the product name in the description. This. Fantastic. I love everything from COSRX. They're a K-beauty brand and they have amazing skincare products, lip products. Everything I've used from them, I could use for the rest of my life and be happy. They're so simple. It's not so expensive and they just work. This lip balm I loved. It was kind of like a Vaseline-y kind of vibe too. I think it had like honey in it. It was like a honey flavor. So it was like kind of sweet. I'll put the name in the description. I've gone through so many of these specific moisturizers. I'm a Kiehl's fanatic. I love Kiehl's. I tried this for the first time maybe two years ago and I've gone through so many of these scents. It's just a very neutral moisturizer. It's light, it doesn't have a strong fragrance, it's good for sensitive skin, it's hydrating, it's good under makeup, it's good before bed. I think this is just a really good whenever, wherever type of moisturizer. Tried and true. Can't go wrong with this. I hate that my hair tie has been on this whole video. I feel like this freaking hair tie makes an appearance in every piece of content I create. Getting rid of her. Then we have this body butter from NCLA Beauty. This cream is thick. It's empty now, so obviously I can't demo it, but it is thick, thick cream, and it's bright white. You put it on your skin and you really have to like rub it in because it's so thick but it's so hydrating and the fragrance of this is amazing. This one is passion fruit. I thought I was gonna end it there, but I decided to show you three more things that I'm not fully out of yet, but I'm like three days away from being out of all three of these. So I'm just gonna include them in this video. One is this concealer from Il Maquillage. It's got a little visual of the color right there. The color I use is 3.5 and it's called FCK I'm Flawless. This concealer is great. I feel like Il Maquillage is known for really great coverage and their concealer Concealer is exactly that. This blends really well. This one also hits the nail on the head with coverage. Next is this natural deodorant from Hume Supernatural. You can see I have like a teeny tiny bit left. That top that you can see, that's literally all that's there. This will maybe last a week longer. It's mycobiome friendly for all skin types, made with prickly pear, paraben free, cruelty free, phthalate free, baking soda free, triclosan free. I don't even know what triclosan is, but Sounds like a good thing. I've been using their deodorant for a really long time. This specific one is unscented. I'm a big fan. I will be repurchasing this or one of the other fragrances. This is the actual last thing of this video. This is a cleansing balm from Shiva Rose. It's called the Blue Butter Cleansing Balm. I used a cleansing balm for the first time maybe a year ago. And just over the last few months, I have become obsessed. So now I have a few different types that I've been trying to see which ones I like best. With cleansing balms, you just put it on your face and it melts away your makeup, your impurities. It just melts everything away. This one I typically leave on for 10 or 15 minutes. It's super hydrating. Then I take it off with a washcloth with some warm water on it. And then I go in and I cleanse with another cleanser. I have maybe two more uses out of this one. That's the end of my second empties haul. I love sharing these videos because I love the products that I love. Now I'm gonna recycle all of these. 
these. This is empty again, but once it fills back to the top, I'll be back with another empty salt. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next video. Bye.